guys, Matthew here. Today, we're going to be comparing the Yushin Little Magic with the Valk 3. In this comparison, we're going to be comparing the shades, the corner cutting, the turning, and the overall performance it solves. We're going to start off the shades with the Yushin Little Magic. So as you can see in this checkerboard pattern, some of the colors do not really look contrast from the others. For example, the blue and green, the green's a little bit dull while the blue is also dull. They're both kind of dark as well. And that is the same for the red and orange. The orange stickers are super dark and look very similar to the red. The only colors that I can kind of give to the Yushin Little Magic are the white and yellow. The yellow is very contrasting from the white as it is dark instead of kind of bright. Now with the Valk, you can see that since the yellow is super bright, it contrasts well with the white. If it was just a little bit darker, I would have just given that side to the Little Magic. The red and orange, the orange is very different from the red, so that's very good. The blue and green the same thing. The green is very different than the blue. If I had to give a cube this category, the winner would be the Vault 3. For the corner cutting, we're going to be starting off with the Vault. So normal corner cutting, it can cut 45 degrees very easily. It can almost get to the reverse corner cutting line with ease. And that just took a little bit more effort and it's very close to the reverse line. And when it's right beside the reverse corner cutting line, it gets a lock up. So normal corner cutting is very good. It can almost cut to the reverse corner cutting line. Now for reverse corner cutting, we're gonna see if it can cut one line. No, it cannot but it can cut before one line. The corner cutting here is very good. The reverse corner cutting is not very good. It can sometimes cut one line. Now, with the Yushin Little Magic, it can cut 45 degrees as well. For a budget cube, that's very good cut more than 45 degrees also with ease, but can it cut super close to the reverse corner cutting line? No, it cannot. It locks up here, but it can cut just a little bit before that with ease. Now for reverse corner cutting, can it cut one line? No, it can't. It wants to go to normal corner cutting instead of reverse corner cutting, but can it cut close to a line? Yes, it can with ease. So that's about as close as the Yushin Little Magic can cut. If I had to give the corner cutting to one cube, I would give it to the Vault Now for turning, we're gonna be testing it with some PLL. So I'm gonna start with the Yushin Little Magic. The Yushin Little Magic is very fast and smooth. It feels a little bit uncontrollable sometimes, but that could be due to the lack of magnets. The Volk is a very stable cube though, so the Yushin Little Magic might have problems with that. The Volk 3 is a very smooth cube. It's also very controllable, but not too fast. I can easily execute most of my algorithms on this, and I find it a very good choice. If I had to give a cube this category, I would give it to the Yushin Little Magic. I just like the speed of the Yushin Little Magic, and it just feels much better than the Vault. Thank you. 
still had a very good performance in Souls. It got me a 728 single and an 877 single, but it wasn't very consistent as the Volk had an 11.1 average and the Yushin Little Magic had an 11.2. So that's like a very narrow win for the Volk. So if you enjoyed this video, please hit the like button as that will support me and my channel. Subscribe to my channel as that will also support me and my channel. Share this video and hit the bell to never miss out on any more Cuban content like this. I'm out. Peace.